Imagine you're in high school and every other student there is a theater or an arts kid. That's not far from the truth here at BYU's new West Campus. I'm here to find out what it takes to take an old high school and turn it into a functioning arts building. So let's take a look. BYU's West Campus has been in the works since 2018 when BYU bought Provo High School. After renovations ended this summer, the College of Fine Arts and Communications is using the old high school as a rest stop on their way to a new arts building. Fine Arts faculty involved in the renovations say what's happening at the old high school is nothing short of a miracle. Just little miracles of finding these spaces that nobody thought would work and then they turned into working fabulously. The kitchen is now a photography darkroom. A weight room is an art gallery and the gymnasium became a stage. Associate Dean Rory Scanlon says students and faculty are taking the unconventional renovations in stride. They've all been excited to try it out because they, they like to work in a new area and, and try something brand new and something very different. Scanlon says in the end, any growing pains will be well worth it as they wait for a new and improved building. A lot of our other areas have been able to expand somewhat a little bit. The new building will have new new facilities that we've never had. Once the new music building is complete in January, the Harris Fine Arts Center will be torn down to make room for a new theater and media arts building. Since it's only a temporary spot, Powell says budget decisions on West Campus had to strike a delicate balance. We wanted to make sure that this was fully operational for our college without putting too much money into it that would just be wasted when we leave from here. As the student body grows, the buildings that hold them need to as well. Scanlon says the expansion will be a turning point for BYU's artists. We're, we're looking at a whole new era for the arts at BYU, and we're pleased that the, the university and the church decided to fund that. Fine arts students and faculty will have to wait around three years for everything to be complete, but by the sound of it, a little creativity in the meantime won't be a problem. For Universe Live, I'm Abby Gunderson.